it's eating time at the ranch again. If you're tired of cooking, or tired of sorta cooking, just tap your favorite app and get a big bow box delivered. With eight pieces of chicken, biscuits, fixins, and tea. It's bow time. After months of rehearsal, Greek life students danced their hearts out at GMU's annual Greek Sing competition last weekend. Students purchased tickets to enjoy the entertainment. The money raised from the tickets went to the Ark of Harrisonburg, which supports people with intellectual and developmental disabilities. According to this year's student director, Nellie Tucker, organizing Greek Sing takes longer than students think. Everyone thinks it starts out like only a few months before. It usually starts a whole year in advance. Um, you start around August and September with booking the AEBC for the event itself. This year, the decision was made to shift the event from a weeknight to a Saturday afternoon due to an increase to two dozen organizations participating. We don't want anyone missing class or skipping class, so we have to wait till around six or seven to start the event if we do it on a weeknight. And the event itself is pretty long. It's about four and a half hours. That's a really long time to ask for them to be there. Students who participated in the competition agree that the switch to a Saturday was a wise choice. I was really happy that it was changed to a weekend because the past two years it was really stressful on like Tuesdays having to like figure out if I had to leave class early. I think a weekend makes sense, They're like, so you don't have to miss class. It would be like just an exhausting night, so I was really happy it was on a Saturday. Tucker says she believes the change in time was a success. Reporting alongside Logan Mitchell, this is Jack Hadley for Breeze TV.